We had him. We had him and he vanished. How? I will not be cold. Not when this monster has done everything in his power to destroy our life. He tried to feed me to those vile women. He killed Lucy. And now he's infecting me now. If I could, I would send his soul forever to burn in hell. Jonathan. He's right. All of you, you listen to me. That poor soul who caused all this misery is the saddest case of all. How can you pity him? Because one day I may become like him, and I may need such pity. We will not let that happen. I've been thinking about this all day. If you see any sign that I am changing... No. Don't talk about it. We must talk about it! Jonathan, I can't bear to think that I might harm anyone that I love, especially you. If you see me changing, you must kill me, the same way you set Lucy free. I need you to promise me. Mina, you will not die, must not. In fact, you must fight to live with every ounce of strength you have. For while you are alive, there is hope. But if you die before he dies, you will be lost like Lucy. What if we get him first? Then his hold over her may be broken and she be well again. Shh! Is he here? <laughs> no. It's his presence. I see. I see what he sees. As if I see through his eyes. My God, come, sit down. Tell me what you see. Nothing. I can't make it out. My brain is in a fog. What's happening to us? They are connected now. Flesh of his flesh and blood of his blood, like he said. Perhaps he does not yet realize or care that she can see through his eyes. If he doesn't find out, we can track him down. We know. Put my watch. I'm going to count backwards from ten. Ten. Nine. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Where are you? I don't know. What do you see? Nothing now. It is dark. What do you hear? Water. I hear water lapping against wood. I hear men's voices overhead, stomping on the wood. He's on a ship. That son of a gun's trying to run away. But where to? Where's he going? Home. He's going home. Back to Transylvania. Yes. We must follow him at once. If this monster be allowed to live, he will only come back when all here are long forgotten. He already has a head start on us over the water. We could go over land. I can arrange transportation. Mr. Harper, stop. I hate to ask this of you. You've been through so much already. But you're the only one among us who knows what we are going up against in that castle. Will you go? I would, surely. But Mina. I'm going with you. You can. My dear, you are far too precious to lose. I am safer with you. And you shall be safer too. You need me. What if he changes course? Or disembarks along the way. I'm connected to him. I can help. She goes. I only ask one thing. I know you don't want to hear this, but it must be said. I need you to promise me, one and all, even you, Jonathan, that should the time come when you are convinced that I am changed, Neither. when it is better that I die than I may live, Promise me you will drive a stake through my heart and give me rest. I swear to you, should that time ever come, I will not flinch. My true friend, I swear as well, and I. I swear the same, my dear Madam Mina. And must I too make such a promise? Yes, you too. You must not shrink. You are nearest and dearest in all the world to me. If it is to be that I must meet death at any hand, let it be at the hand of him that loves me best. I swear it. Thus 
also we ministers to God's own wish that this world and the men for whom his son died will not be given over to monsters. He have allowed us to redeem one soul already, and we go out like the old knights of the cross to redeem more. Like them, we travel toward the sunrise, and like them, if we fall, we fall in good course. <laughs>